So one of the things that it's really important to consider when working with children and young people with Down syndrome is their developmental stage. In traditional grief thought and theories, there's, uh, children are kind of categorised into their age groups and what will benefit them most of all within their stage of development and their age and working with grief. That doesn't necessarily fit with children who would have Down syndrome um, because they're very often at a different developmental age as well. It's really important to meet the individuals as well, where they are at um, and where their experiences are. And also to uh, allow that clients can say no. You know, we can give them all this lovely work to do, but they have the full permission to say no, that they don't want to engage at this time. And that's also really important. And that can be a really huge thing in their, their grief process as well. Because grief so much gets taken away and out of our control. And that saying no can be putting something back into their control for them. And just to say it's never too late to engage in any of this work with, with your child, with your young person, um, or with the person that you are supporting. Uh, it's always a great opportunity to have these conversations because even if they haven't happened before, they might still be having those big feelings and they can be talked about and expressed. <laughs>